I'm going to give this a good score. I'm not going to give it a great score, though, but I like it. I like Heaven Hill. I think Heaven Hill makes a lot of good products. Now, their blended whiskeys can be, um, you know, treacherous, but then you're not paying anything. Um, I would say... Um, like Heaven Hill 6, which is now Heaven Hill 5. No, like uh, Heaven Hill, Kentucky. Well, that one actually was pretty good because y'all put that in the... Um, Heaven Hill 6. We put the Heaven Hill, remember we put the Heaven Hill um, Kentucky blended whiskey in the CBS? Remember yeah, that? but that's just regular Heaven Hill. I was talking about that Heaven Hill 6 that everybody was chasing down for a while oh, and it became Heaven Hill 5. I haven't seen that, no. It's not hard. But I'm talking about like some of their off brands like Kentucky Gold they, they, or Samuel, um, uh, Samuel, I can't think of it. But uh, those are like. Yikes. So you want to give this a score? Yeah. Okay. Um, I think to be fair, 92 is a fair score. A minus. 92, it's really good. Uh, I would get it for $14.99, and um, I would not be opposed to revisiting revisiting it and give it giving it a second assessment, although it would be a third because we did do it once before. We I did, All the video doesn't exist. I like it. Yeah, it's a good. I'm, I'm going to give it a higher score. Price. I'm going to uh, give it a, a 95. Uh, I I don't see anything wrong with it. 95. Absolutely nothing wrong with it, other than the fact that you're a little biased to uh, Kentucky whiskeys and uh, bourbons. It's just not going to have that. So, with that said, to me this this is like a whiskey or a bourbon that doesn't have that burnt. Charges to it. I wasn't biased. It's just I'm not used the, to the the body, the flavor, how it's put together. It's nothing really wrong. It's not overly sweet. You know, you think corn. It's like oh, high fructose corn syrup. It's going to be really sweet. Oh no, it's or nothing like, like that. No, no it's it's uh, balanced. It's balanced. Yeah. So it's it's really good. Uh, is it something you want to drink straight? At eh, hundred proof, not really. Would it make a good mixer? Oh, absolutely. Any kind of if you want to put soda pop or. Or juice, whatever it is you want with this, you know, makes old fashioned if you want. This would probably work really good. Uh, at hundred proof, it's 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 a tasty whiskey. Well, I'll say this: I'm glad you let me try it. Um, I'm sorry that the first time we did it um, six years ago, for whatever reason, didn't come out. But uh, yeah, it's it's nice. I mean, I would recommend it, and I would buy it. Yes, I would recommend it, and I would buy it. All, yes. with, no matter what I said earlier. So, Lazy Lay, Bon Tarn Lay, a very nice product. And I'm going to end this review by saying, y'all go to Bardstown, Kentucky, and tour the Heaven Hill Distillery, although they don't actually give tours. And if you see if you see this, it's very affordable. Just pick it up and try it. If you don't like it, you can always pass it off on someone that does like it. Oh, come on, $15? It's definitely worth it. Worth give me a break. Thank you for watching this video production. And drink better... Whiskies. Kids. Kids. <laughs>